Hey Wondering Minds learners, I John Wickliff welcomes you all on Wondering Minds YouTube channel. Today we'll learn about me means John Wickliff, dear learners, pyare dostu, main aaj aap sab ke beech aaya hu aur main aaj aapko apne bare bahut kuch batauga jo literary point of view se bahut important hone wala hai agar aapne hamara Wondering Minds YouTube channel join nahi kiya hai. तू आप सब इसे सब्सक्राइब कर ले लाइक और कमेंट और शेयर भी करे ताकि आने वाली वीडियोस का नोटिफिकेशन आप स्पीको टाइम पी मिलता रहे प्यारे दोस्तों आप सब वंडरिंग माइंड्स का टेलीग्राम ग्रुप भी ज्वाइन कर सकते हैं फॉर अर बेटर प्रैक्टिस ऑफ क्वेश्चंस डेली क्विज टाइमिंग 9 पीएम डियर लर्नर्स लेट्स मूव टू द फर्स्ट स्लाइड ऑन आवर लेक्चर बिफोर स्टार्टिंग आई होप ऑल ऑफ यू कनेक्ट विद मी from beginning to end. Let's start. I. John Wycliffe was an English theologian and reformer, also called the Morning Star of the Reformation. Critical of the papacy felt that all Christians should have access to the Bible in the vernacular. My Bible becomes first complete word-for-word -word translation of Vulgate into English, into a Midland dialect, wife Wycliffe. Let's move to the other one, I. John Wycliffe. Two versions completed, first by Nicholas of Hereford, up to Baruch 320, remainder completed by an unknown scholar. A few years later, a second version, revised, less literal and less Latinate, completed by John Purvey. Complete Wycliffe, Bible remained unprinted until 1850, Lollards. The Lollards translated the Bible into their vernacular language, English. Most significant heretical group in England, before the Reformation Piare Dostu, let's move to the another slide. Let's move to the other one. Dear learners, Sir John Wycliffe, also known as the Lollard's Bible Extant in 170 copies. Dear Wandering Minds learners, now we know about Lollard's. Followers of Wycliffe came to be known as Lollard's. Name perhaps derived from Dutch term Lollard, meaning Mumbler. Sect driven out of Oxford, in 1382, some devout members circulated Wycliffe's teachings and the Lollard Conclusions. 1394. Let's move to the another slide. Now, dear learners, what is Lollardy? Political and religious movement, mid 14th century to mid 16th. No central belief or doctrine, basis, translation of the Bible into vernacular founder John Wycliffe. Mostly criticized the Western Church, wrote the Twelve Conclusions. Let's move to the another slide. The Twelve Conclusions. Written by a group of Lollards in 1395, examples of conclusions. Church leaders shouldn't accumulate wealth, Matumava's greed, should not deal with secular matters, power, the Church is corrupt, Priests should be accountable by law, rejected pilgrimages, denounced war and violence. Wycliffe's end, Wycliffe died of paralysis on December 31st, 1384. In 1428 his body was disinterred and burned, and the ashes cast into the swift, a tributary of the Avon. McNeil, P. 63. However, his ideas were not so easily put out of the way, and many followed his path. Thanks for connecting us, dear learners. Be continue with us, we'll coming back with another important literary figure, till then bye-bye.